uh, I'm going to get a lot of comments on this because people back in India might not accept what I'm doing here. It's around uh, 7.45. Prashant, are you tired? No. Hi everyone, uh, welcome to Mars Vlogs. Today I'm going to show you what my part-time job is. Uh, I'm going to get a lot of comments on this because people back in India might not accept what I'm doing here. But then this is how I make some extra income. Uh, as you all know, Prashant is here. He's on a visit visa, so he can't officially work. So we have decided that we will do um, some part-time job together so that we can spend time together as well as make some money out of it. So that's it. I'll show you what's going on. Okay. So I'm just heading out uh, for the job. Uh, today is a Sunday afternoon and today is Father's Day. So we are expecting it to be a good day. Ready for the day? Today we are going out for uh, our part-time job. So you must be wondering how two people are doing the part-time job. Well, uh, it's a delivery job that we do. Uh, the reason why we have taken delivery job is mainly because it's uh, very flexible in the sense we don't have to actually work on a specific time or a day or anything. We can just give our schedule and then work accordingly. And uh, uh, if you ask me which uh, delivery have I signed up with, it's a, a company called as I Orders. Uh, so basically they have tie up directly with the restaurant and not uh, with, it's not like a, a marketplace kind of a setup uh, like Swiggy or Uber or um, what do you say, uh, Skip the Dish which is here in Canada. Um, so we can give them a schedule on a weekly basis and then you know do deliveries for them. Uh, it works out quite okay in the sense uh, we don't have uh, to actually pay them anything or you know we just need to log in on the given time that we have actually opted for and then log in and pick up food from the uh, delivery restaurant I mean from the restaurant and then deliver it to the uh, customer so that's the basic job so uh, as I mentioned earlier like in India this wouldn't be considered as a job especially for people who have done MBA or you know who's already completed their masters and all those things uh, I'm sure that people are doing these days because of COVID and all those things many people actually started doing it uh, back in India also but here this is very common in the sense uh, most of the students who uh, or students or even people who are uh, like us like who have kids and all those things for that extra income you can always uh, take up random jobs like this like uh, deliveries or you know uh, cleaning services or uh, all these actually pay per service for us this is per order that we get paid and they give us a uh, I mean customers tip us based on uh, the order value most of the orders we get a tip so it's exciting to actually uh, get a tip after an order because then you know it's it's kind of like a motivation for us uh, so today we started a little early because it's father's day it's, it's going I hope it's going to a busy day so when we make some good money out of it um, and then it's what around 4 15 p.m. Uh, we have opted for a shift till 8 p.m. Uh, 8 p.m. or 9 p.m. depending on how much time they want us to work um, and then we head back home so this is a part-time job that we do on a regular basis in a sense soon after my work that's my regular work from 7 to 5 uh, I go home pick up Prashant and then we go for deliveries till around 8 or 9 depending on how busy the day is um, and it's worked out well for us so we might continue this uh, with them it's a high order skip the dishes is also there uh, but again I personally haven't opted for skip the dish mainly because of uh, because I tied up with I orders initially itself so I have not tied up with skip the dish or Uber skip the dish is more prominent in Rajaina as compared to any other services so um, yeah so that's it so this actually gives us also a chance me and Rajan to be together during our work and spend a lot of time together rather than you know us working separate jobs. Rashan is not legally allowed to work in Canada so uh, all these documentation is done on my name 
and how we can make some extra. It is difficult for uh, two people to live on one person's salary, uh, so it is important that you make some additional income uh, while you, you know, uh, while there are like most of the people who watch my vlogs also, they are people who are um, like mid-aged or who wants to come to Canada with their family. Uh, so I always advise them, please bring one person come first and then you know uh, you can bring the other person and even if the person is coming on a visit visa like how Prashant did his work permit is still pending you can always take up such jobs it is a little hectic I'm, uh, that's one thing for sure because after your job coming and again doing a part time is hectic but uh, the initial struggle is always there right for any kind of uh, uh, in a new country to settle down so that's what we are doing here also so uh, people who see my Instagram stories or you know vlogs and all they think that life is very fancy here no it's not fancy it is definitely fancy in one way to keep it entertaining we do go out uh, apart from this we also have the fun that we have to have in life but we work hard okay uh, and this is one thing that we do to keep our expenses going on so I'll show you more during the deliveries so this is their app and we've got our first order and Prashant is here uh, he is the one who takes care of going, picking up the order and coming back and we are at Ritzvan Pizza now. So as I mentioned earlier, this company is called as I Orders. Uh, it's run by uh, two Malayalis, uh, Rakesh and Danish. Uh, they came to Rajayan a couple of years ago and they have actually developed a software mainly uh, for the restaurants. It's like uh, ordering software. Um, so uh, restaurants can punch in the order details and those kind of things. And they also have a delivery wing for which I am working. Uh, and uh, it is it is not like a skip or other uh, delivery services. Uh, it's exclusively a software for the restaurant. And this delivery service is an addition, additional service they're actually providing to the uh, restaurants. So it's worked well for us. We have been doing it since the time we shifted to Regina. That is uh, from April end or May or something. And uh, so far so good. It has not been uh, bad. Most of the days we make good money. The Prashant is coming with the order. They give the bag. So we've reached now at the delivery location and uh, Makita. Right. Prashant is going uh, to deliver the order. Just give me a minute, I just need to call the customer just to tell we are here uh, because in some cases uh, it's a little difficult to coordinate just give me a moment hello hi uh, we are here to deliver the order okay i'll be right back okay right. sure thank you yeah, so we just need to inform them and they'll come and collect it if it's an apartment or something. Uh, so uh, if it's a really good day, okay, I mean in the sense like uh, we have had days where we made $100 per day. Uh, so we would have done like 9 to 10 deliveries. Maybe we would have started by 4 or 5 p.m. until 8.30, p.m. and we would have made $100. So in 4 to 5 hours, $100 is good. So, but every day is not going to live like that. Some days we'll just make $20. Some days we'll just make $50. Some days will be really good. So on an average, if you're working every day and you're making this money easily, you can make an additional, maybe, uh, you know, uh, 200, 300, or we've even had a week where we made $400 a week. Uh, so when you uh, actually, you know, compile the whole thing on a monthly basis, you can make around 800 to $900 extra other than, your regular work uh, uh, as an additional income especially when uh, you are uh, two people and then only one person is working this is one way to make additional income you have to calculate also whether you know the petrol expenses will work my car drinks petrol not even drinks gulps petrol so it's it, it uh, it's not break even we make a little bit profit but then uh, 
it'll be better if we have a smaller car or you know a car, car which has more mileage and um, so far it's been good uh, and uh, these the management of i orders is also very helpful you know in the sense uh, they actually in case i'm not able to attend one day or you know if i tell them what the reason is they are okay to actually adjust the schedule for us yeah so uh, like what i was telling we're going to uh, return the machine and the bag now we've got the second order uh, which is towards the downtown area so we'll just drop it back and come because otherwise you know since it's a busy day the restaurants will also require the machine or uh, the bag so rather than keeping it with us and then them following it up following uh, up regarding that we would rather give it back and come uh, and uh, uh, what else do you want to say prashant he he is this is actually his job uh i would say because he does a, ma a major work uh, but um, i'm the one who's driving uh everything every her documentation and everything is done on my name because i hold the sin here he's legally not allowed to work uh but this is one way where you know both of us can pitch in and work and help out each other uh, so he's doing his part of bringing in some money into the uh, account uh, so um, we have some time before uh going for our next pick up so since it's evening and uh we didn't actually have coffee or tea from home we're just picking up a coffee from tim hortons most of you all might know uh tim hortons is like coffee day in uh, india very very common uh it's there in every nook and corner of uh, canada not only in saskatchewan everywhere the minute you land in the uh, airport itself you have uh tim hortons so uh usually we take a drive through mainly because it's easier uh, so i'll show you how to go about hi there one small french vanilla with quarter coffee okay and then yours one large french vanilla large french vanilla yeah quarter coffee as well no no it's for 95 yeah thank you very much thank you so this is our regular order french vanilla coffee Uh, I like it with a little bit with uh, coffee, a uh, with a little bit of coffee. Uh, this was again introduced by two of my friends. They are the ones who actually told me it might taste better with coffee. Actually, it does. But Prashant actually likes it just with coffee. Uh, uh, we'll collect this, then go towards downtown for our next order. So this is uh, these are things. Uh, some of the jobs that usually most of the students or working people do, like part-time delivery jobs, uh, people can take up skip the dish. Just sign up with them with all your details, and then you can start it off. So that's one of the main advantages of uh, you know being in Canada. You can make a there's a lot of ways to make extra income. And uh, but the only thing is that you need a car, uh, and that's one of the reason why I bought a car also because I knew that once Prashant comes in, uh, we will be starting the delivery jobs. Mm, many people in the videos, uh, previous videos, had asked about, uh, you know, what are the part-time jobs that we get here, or you know, uh, how can I make extra income and those kind of things. Uh, so I had another part-time job before, which was an online job, remote job, more like a call center thing. Uh, so after my studies, hey, let me just get the coffee. Yeah? job before uh, which was a toronto based company and uh, i used to work with them uh, this was when i was uh, study in other uh, what am i saying some other people in my class like other students they used to work at walmart or you know they used to be working at uh, superstore or petrol even bunks, tim hortons even tim hortons for that matter uh, but in my case i opted for an online job because uh, Actually, I wanted to spend more time, um, you know, with the studies, or because I have actually spent money and come here, so I didn't actually want to waste time uh, by traveling around. And I didn't have a car at that time. It was okay. I mean, we could even travel by bus for our work, but 
somehow I felt the online jobs are better. So after applying, since I had call center experience, I had done it back in Bangalore in 2004 or 5. So because of that, I got through that. That was also a very good job. In fact, I could just log in by 4 o'clock in the evening. I used to work till around 7 to 8. And I get the same pay what other people used to get. Like if you even if you go work in a, a restaurant industry where you actually need to put in a lot of physical work, I used to get the same kind of uh, salary sitting at home. So I prefer doing that. Mm. And then uh, after uh, I got, I mean, I took, obviously took up a full-time job. So it's after that that I decided that I will uh, take up this delivery job because I stopped the other part-time job because uh, the part-time job and my main job, the timings were not matching and I couldn't take that up. Uh, and then Prashant was also here even I thought, you know, because since he's on Mr. Visa, he's home most of the time, like from morning till uh, evening when I am at work. And it's quite boring to be at home the whole, uh, whole time. Not for him because he is like uh, hooked on to Netflix and all those things and he keeps himself busy. Uh, in fact, he is also the one who is managing the house these days uh, with the cooking and cleaning and all those things. Uh, so it helps uh, me uh, on a personal level because I really don't need to plan much about what to cook or you know like plan out things at home because that's taken care of by Mr. Prashant. Um, so until he gets a job this is going to be how things are he's going to manage things at home and then after my work my work gets over by five I come back I pick up uh, Prashant and then go out uh, for delivery still around eight or nine so that's our current routine uh, one I will also show you one of these days what a day in my life looks like so that you know uh, what all we do as uh, working people or what I used to do as a student I'll also explain that we are almost at the end of the shift it's around uh, 7 45 Prashant are you tired no so we just uh, completed around seven to eight orders I think now we'll head for one more order and then push off from there um, that's the current plan uh, I will tell you how many orders we completed at the end of the video and how much money we made so we just got done with um, the uh, deliveries for today we did around seven to eight orders I think the eighth, the eighth one was the last one so approximately we would have made um, around 70 dollars today uh, which is average uh, for uh, such deliveries so that's all this is my part-time job mm, and uh, so far it's been good uh, if you have any questions or comments regarding this please post it below and do subscribe to my channel that's all for now bye bye